Welcome, inquisitive souls, to the enigmatic tale of Necropolis Island, once one of the largest and strangest enclaves in the realm of Doviri. Today we delve into the mysteries that surrounded their peculiar burial ground, forever lost to the annals of time. My name is Quad and I will be your storyteller for today's tale of the Hall of Mirrors series, Doviri edition. This tale will be quite short, so I will take some of your time to express my gratitude to everyone enjoying this series. I myself love Warframe lore and writing these scripts as a story, so I hope you like them as well. Liking and commenting on these videos really helps me in the YouTube algorithm, since these videos are not getting many views due to getting buried with much more sought out stuff like Wisp Prime and her assets. Anyways, I'm glad that you came along. Let's start now. The Doll Mausoleum was located on the Necropolis Island, among the myriad of islands that dotted the landscape of Doviri. Its sprawling expanse appeared to be a vast burial ground, where gravestones, wooden crosses, sarcophagi and ornate tombs littered the terrain. However, those who dared to venture into these cryptic abodes were met with a baffling revelation. Instead of the expected cadavers and skeletal remains, each coffin housed a simulacrum of the human form, constructed with meticulous craftsmanship. Wooden skeletons carved in intricate detail, rotting straw-filled corpses adorned in tattered garments, and decaying clay faces sculpted with haunting precision. Even the tiniest bones were whittled down from larger ones, adding to the surreal nature of this necropolis. The Doll Mausoleum, an extraordinary structure within the necropolis, defies the conventional expectations of burial grounds. Built on a small scale, its cavities held coffins containing miniature human figures. These figures represented diverse individuals, often with brightly colored hair and adorned in peculiar one-piece hooded suits made of black leather. A word around the town is that they could be the Tenno, or some people called colonists, or something like that. It is whispered that Thrax himself would occasionally visit the Doll Mausoleum, often alone. The purpose of these visits remains a haunting enigma, concealed within the depths of his secrets. The truth of what transpired within these hallowed chambers remains veiled, known only to the shadows. But alas, the once intriguing Necropolis Island now rests in the embrace of the ever-encroaching void, forever lost from our grasp. Its secrets, like whispers, carried the weight on the wind, shall remain an eternal mystery, forever beyond our understanding. Another tantalizing enigma destined to elude us for all time. With this I thank you for passing by and wish you a very nice day. Goodbye.